Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, as many of you may know, for Windows you get different types of licensing. So you get OEM, retail or volume. So just wanted to show you a quick video, if you would be interested, as to how you can check the type of Windows license installed on your device. And this could be handy um, in a lot of different uh, circumstances. Now, first of all, before we do that, um, let's just look at the three types. First of all, and in no particular order, you get a OEM license, which stands for Original Equipment Manufacturer License, which basically refers to the license that a manufacturer installs on a new device. And it also means that the product key isn't transferable. And you can't use it to activate another installation unless obviously you reactivate in a new installation on the same computer. Then the next license you get is a retail a license that refers to the one you acquire when purchasing a copy of Windows 11 or Windows 10 from um, a retail store or online from an online retailer. And this means that you, uh, you can transfer the product key to another computer as long as you deactivate the old device. And then the third one is a volume license, which is designed for large businesses, corporations, enterprises, education, government departments, and so on. And um, usually this volume license allows organizations to use one master product key to activate any installation of Windows in that particular organization. So that's just a brief summary in case you would be interested. Now, how we can check on Windows 10 and Windows 11 to see what type of license is used on your device is using Command Prompt or PowerShell. And if you don't know where those are, you can just do a search accordingly. I have my PowerShell in my right-click Start Menu Context Menu. So you open up PowerShell or Command Prompt and you run that as administrator. Um, you need to run it as admin, else it will not work. And then what you do is you enter this command and I'll leave that down below for you to copy and paste which is slmgr space forward slash dlr and then once you've entered that you hit enter give that a second and there we go it says windows core single language edition and it says oem so this means I'm running a license that refers to the license that a manufacturer installed on this new device which means um, this product key isn't transferable, as I said, and I can't use it to activate another installation unless um, I'm reactivating or a new installation of the, on the same computer, which I have actually done before. Um, my hard drive crashed about a year and a half ago and I upgraded it and I had to reinstall Windows. So that's why I could keep the same license. So you will either see a OEM, retail or volume. And I thought... Um, you might may be interested in this, and this could be quite handy in certain, uh, in certain circumstances. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.